Hello, my name is Michael Evans, and this is Crash and Board. So today I was out and I was at one of my local friendly gaming stores and I've been thinking about picking this game up for a little while because I've heard a few good things about it. It's, it was 40% off because, well, as you can see, it's been around for a while. The packaging, the plastics have practically come off already. So this is Defenders of the Last Stand. Uh, it's a post-apocalyptic board game. Uh, it is cooperative. It's supposed to have a ton of minis. It's supposed to play a lot like a, a Pandemic. So post-apocalypse, like Pandemic, a bunch of minis. Sure, why not? And 40% off. So we have action chart. We got the cheat sheets, and again, we'll go in for a closer look in a minute. Mm. The rule book. Plus, it has almost a westerny feel. Got some tokens. Good size board. Bunch of baggies of various size, which is good. Cheat sheets, I think. Got the characters. The characters are villains. There are a lot of minis in here. I'm guessing these are bad guys. I'm guessing these are your heroes. Roblox, I think, and on. Got a bunch of dice for your combat. More bad guys, I'm guessing. Get even more minis. in a few minutes and we've got some cards so I'm gonna I'm gonna open them up for the closer look so let's take a closer look at what's inside now this is a, a good size box and it's pretty full a look at the rule book Got a western sort of feel to it. There's Dallas for the eyes. Some charts. This is going to be a table hog, that's for sure. Good size map. 
several tokens. It's all nicely divided. This one is bashed in a bit. When I first opened it, I fixed it. Take a look at some of the cards first, then we'll go into the minis. Start it with the mini cards. You got a bunch of different types of mini cards. I like the art on it. Nothing else. The art. Nothing else. The art is pretty cool. Well, you know that card, but you know, the art in the game in general is pretty cool. These cards seem to have like. Little flavor tacks and rules and the mutations. These are all very good mutations, very helpful mutations. I wonder if there are any bad mutations. Weakness when you take a wound. Okay. So apparently, I do have some bad mutations. Not a lot of bad mutations. Some bad mutations. Not a lot of bad ones. Those are monstrosities. Ancient tech, okay. Artifacts. Bazooka. Okay, any game you get a bazooka in, it's got to be a good game. Especially a cooperative game. A cooperative game, you get a bazooka and it's great. Then I don't have to worry about someone else getting into the that bazooka. Well, Area 51. It's 
explore our gods explore our god's eye forest. Secure the autonomous plant. <laughs> Painting of an ancient god's paper of Elvis. Velvet Elvis. Painting of an ancient goddess. Marilyn Monroe, I believe. I better be Marilyn Monroe or else there's something wrong with me. Body armor. Look at some of the bigger cards now. Mm -hmm. Looks like those different types, like these are the same as both sides. I'll take a closer look in a minute. I'm really not sure. These are the types of cards we're going to be looking through here. Outside that forest. Really looking forward to figuring out this game. Looks like there's going to be a fair bit to it, but hopefully, it should be hopefully easy enough to learn. Joey died here. It's not that sounds slightly foreboding. Death's Main City. Oh, that's a fun place to visit, I'm sure. Madman Villa. McCormick Farm. Devil's Junction. The Pest Hole. plant. In the future we don't where we're going we don't have A's. What's the air base? Saloon. So these guys have A's. And these are the ones that were the same both sides. Okay, not exactly the same on both sides, but pretty close. See what the other big deck has. 
because this one has two different types of cards. They have the Raiders and these ones. Crank. Like I said, I like the art style of this game. Very Mad Max y slash. Half is Mad Max, half is Wild West, but it all seems to fit together. So. Very Mad Max like. I don't know why one of them is always flipped upside down for each type. It's kind of annoying. I don't know if there's a reason for it or what. I think that's probably a bad thing. Cards. Baggies here. These things I'm thinking are the characters. I think these are villains. These are the different gangs or whatever. So I'm guessing. Quite sure what these things are. I think that it's blockades. And you have tokens of various colors. But now we'll get into the meat of it. Go into the minis. Kind of a cheap blast bendy plastic which probably aren't good for painting that's not going to stop me really small compared to Acadia Quest ones yeah compared to Acadia Quest ones they're really tiny still We'll probably still end up trying to paint them. Probably not 
for a little while. I'm pretty sure these are the heroes. Oh, the D6s, normal D6s, so. I think these are all the same sculpt. And of course, there's one for each, one color for each faction, I think. I'm pretty sure they're all the same sculpt, so I'm just going to take one out for each. This, this could be, this could keep me, this one game keep me painting for a while. This is much smaller and they don't have a base. Although then there is... Motorcycles, so they probably all go on the motorcycle. Or you can fight them on the motorcycle, lost motorcycle, or something like that. I don't know. I'm gonna have to look into it. I'm gonna get a couple of, I think these are bosses. Bigger, chunkier. These ones won't be as difficult to paint, I don't think. Well, still the same sort of material. Then again, I've painted I mean, it's that material before. Very Mad Max. That's kind of cool. I John Quint Buffalo. Like about to rock. These guys are the evil mutants. So yeah, so that's everything from here. A ton of minis. I will be this will keep me painting for a while. Huge map to hold all the minis. 
which is good. I will make that. So I'm looking forward to learning this. Hopefully this is a lot like uh, pandemic like it's supposed to be. Should make it much easier to learn and more likely to get on to get it to the table. If you like what you're seeing, please like, subscribe, comment. Love getting comments. Also, you can join our Facebook group, see what we're up to. Uh, I'm trying to post uh, at least some, you know, when I'm likely to get videos up. So, you know, if you want to join and talk to us there, go ahead. Um, other than that, thank you for watching. This is McCartney Boards. Have a good evening.